IDs in my bag. In the bag? Yes, I'm a minor, sir. Listen, I'm a minor, sir. I have security guards. They left that in my bag, sir. I did not okay. pack my bag. Well, we can get that all straightened out. Please. On December 12, 2022, the Broward County Sheriff's Office would receive multiple notifications from TSA agents regarding multiple firearms being discovered in a bag during check-in process. Upon their arrival, authorities identified the lead actor, Demetrius Flannery, from 50 Cent's television series BMF as the individual attempting to transport the firearms in his travel bag. Firearms, magazine, possible second gun. You want me to bring it to the side? No, you can leave it. During the investigation process, TSA agents would also discover ammunition alongside an illegal substance residue located in a go yard handbag. Response to the checkpoint reference to an item firearms at lane number two, Delta checkpoint. And advise the uh, Delta unit. What's that? It looks like there's firearms in it. I know, but un sir, unfortunately, there's certain procedures we have to follow okay, anytime listen. something comes in that's prohibited, correct? Right. So listen. You sir. understand that, correct? Do you have your ID on you? Sir, my ID's in my bag. In the bag? Yes, I'm a minor, sir. Listen, I'm a minor, sir. I have security guards. They left that in my bag, sir. I did not okay. pack my bag. Well, we can get that all straightened out Please, after the fact, okay? okay thank you. But, but until then, I have to put you in handcuffs until we figure this out. Okay. Okay, you call, understand that? Can I call my mom or somebody? We'll, we'll do that after. Okay. All right, just turn around for me. Be cooperative. Everything's on video and, and audio surveillance. Plus, I'm on body cam. You understand that? Okay. I'm just. This is just for your safety and everybody else around you because there's guns involved, okay, or possible guns. We have to confirm it. Okay. X-ray doesn't tell us 100 percent. Okay. It just says there's a possibility, and that's what it appears to be. You understand? Do you have anything else on you at this point? No. So okay. I promise I don't. Okay. Just an actor, sir. No, I, I understand. Man. Do you have a concealed weapons permit or anything like no, that? I don't, sir. They left that in my bag. My little brother's outside waiting for me, sir. I promise you, sir, that's not mine. Okay. I have security guards, sir. I am sir. Okay. See how much jury I have on me? Listen, it's, it's, that's okay if you got that. The problem is, is bringing it into the checkpoint. Sir, but I would Just never have a seat do that. for me. My mom's a father to Just have a seat. I would never do that, sir. I promise you, man. I'm a private school. I'm a good kid, man. I'm not saying you're bad. Have I mistreated you no, or anything? Not at all. Not at all, sir. Okay. I'm just trying to tell you, sir. But you understand really? the severity of what is occurring, I right? I would never do this. I fly every week. Yeah. Listen. If what you're telling sir. me is true, we can work things out. Yes, please. Okay? Please, officer, please. I'm working. But there's procedures we have to follow. Hello. Uh, there, it looks like possibly two guns and a few mags. He's saying that he's an actor and he has private security guards. Okay, does, does he have he a security pack. weapons permission? No, no sir. he doesn't have a... Listen, uh, sir, I, I was going to tell right? you. His ID and everything is supposedly in the bag. Listen, where, sir, where I want to tell you one second. I fly every week, sir. I have two security guards and we are rushing to the airport. I have a premiere. I'm an actor. That's why I have a big chain. Me and 50 Cent have a TV show. Oh, sir, this will ruin my life. Do you have a concealed weapons permit? No, sir, but I've never. Tight. Don't say a word. Okay. I've never. I would never bring this in the air force, sir. Okay. I promise you. Are they traveling with you? No, they're in the car. But they're. I, I promise you. They okay. Left is there a number bag, for for them? Yes, I have a number for and, them. And you have, is it a company that works for you? Like you hire, or they're like personal? They're personal security guards. Sir. Right, right. But do you I have a phone hire them independently? You hire them yes, through like hire, a like an agency? Independently. Okay. What's What's your first name, sir? God. Demetrius Fenner, D E M E T R I U S. I'm gonna miss my flight. What time is your flight? Uh, the board's at 2 p.m. Uh, yeah, you're definitely not making it because it's almost 2 now. Oh, and what's your last name? Oh my god. F L E N O R Y. F L E N O R Y. N as in November? Or M as in Mike? Sorry, while you were talking, this was going in my ear. Like. L E N N O R Y. Uh -huh. O R Y. Oh my God, these people are going to run. And what's your date of birth? 422. Was it? April 22nd, 2000. 3530. Man. 30, guys. I can't believe it, man. Never mind, I thought you were calling. 
So you have no idea, man. And where you live, here or somewhere else? Yes, I live here. I'm What's your address here? here? Was that Hollywood? Yes, sir, Hollywood, Florida. What's the zip over there? 33019. Yes, sir, if you grab my phone, I can have the security guard tell you yourself that he left him in there, sir. I'll okay. push you to the airport, I promise you, sir. What's, what's the phone number to, to the guy? I don't know, I have to get it from my phone. I don't know, if, my phone is right there by my bags, though, sir. So All right, we'll, we'll work that out then, okay? Please work with me, What's sir. What's his name? Please. Omar. What's just, Omar? Omar. Please. R-I-G-H-T? Yes, and Mandrell Royal Security Guard. And what's the other guy's name? Mandrell, M-A-N-D-R-E-L-L. M-A-N-D-R-E-L-L. Uh-huh. Okay. And those are your security? Yes, those are my security. And you know who packed your bag? Yes. Who security packed my bag, sir? I would never do this, sir. Is that something normal? Because, like, unfortunately, when you come, I know, but unfortunately, when you come through, one of the questions is, have you packed your own bag? Because you, you're responsible for anything in. I have clear. I have clear, sir. They ne never asked me that, but I have clear. They never asked me that. Right, I'm just saying, but those those are one of the standard ones when you book your ticket. It tells you make sure, because... Oh, so listen, I'm an actor. I fly. Yeah, I, I, three, I four got days, you. Sir. And I listen, I, I move fast, sir. Because my straw was late here, coming to my flight's boarding right now. And you're I flying with never, Delta today? Yes, I fly with Delta. My mom works for Delta 30 years. Yeah. Which flight you going on? You know? Delta, uh, um, to where? FLL to DTW to Detroit. I have a premiere tomorrow. I'm an actor. Of my, my show is nearly on stars. Mm -hmm. Like, if I go to jail, my career is ruined, sir. So, well, nobody says you're going to jail yet, okay? We have to verify everything and check what's your status before we make that determination, okay? But I'll tell you, normally our policy here is if you have a concealed weapons permit and you bring one in, listen, it's, a, it's an arrestable offense, but we don't physically arrest you, but we arrest you on paper and you promise to go to court on it. If you don't have a concealed weapons, our general policy, everything is subject to, you know, circumstances, so, but our general policy is that we have to physically arrest you and take you physically to jail and bond out if you don't have one. That's our normal process, okay? But it's our supervisor's call to, they have the capability of taking all the circumstances in place and they can override that general policy and make exceptions to it, okay? I don't know what's going to happen because I'm not the boss, you understand? Can I talk to the boss, sir? So, we'll get to that once he's going to be on the way because anytime firearm comes, the supervisor has to show up. So, we have to, uh, we're going to clear his property but once you guys take out the gun, but he, needs a, he also needs a patch on Okay. So, uh, once we clear all that. Okay. Do you know where your boarding pass and ID is? It's in my bag. In the bag? Yes. In the bag with the zipper on the top? Small bag. Small bag. Small bag. Small bag. Small bag. Small bag. My ID? My ID? My ID? Uh, if I once I get his, uh, you have his ID? I I got name and the birth. Okay, okay. I'll run it like this if you want, but you yeah. should wait for the ID and get it. It's not. It's just anything that's like computer based has to be out, any electronics has to be outside independent. Man, good thing I ain't need to catch my flight. So, you're not on the same flight? Huh? You guys are not on the same flight? Well, we're on the same flight, but I'm just saying, like, I'm glad it ain't like. Oh, you guys don't know each other? I thought you guys were. Oh, no, no. He's oh, a okay. actor. I seen him on TV. Oh, okay, okay. I got you. I got you. So, we don't have a back, unfortunately. That's, that's TSA. That's not ours. Oh, that's not Yes, that's a private screening if they had to search you. It's not ours. So what show are you on? BMF. It's called BMF. 50 cent, you know 50 cent? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know 50 cent. He has his own show? It's my show. Oh, it's your show. Yeah, it's my show. Okay. He, uh, like, supports it or sponsors it or something? Or? So what does BMF stand for? I see it on your chain. It stands for um, Black Mafia. Uh, it's like my dad had like this little cruise. So my dad was like, you know, you know like the Black Pablo Escobar. Right, okay. Back in the 80s, you know. You know, he went to jail and everything. But he just made a show about it. And I got blessed to play. Okay, so you played your dad. I played my dad. Okay. You like the Sopranos. Like, okay, okay. Okay. On the second season right now. So how was that experience? You don't have the answer, I'm just asking you out of curiosity. Amazing, I love it. That's why I take my career serious, man. Like I fly with security.
but today they couldn't come because I had to hurry up. But it looks like your security screwed up and they left they they stuff did. in your bag they instead did. of taking it with them. They did. They did, because we have a lot of firearms. So, so that, that was the two firearms. We have four firearms. They carry two apiece. So they left the two in my bag because they were at my condo last night. I told them to pack my bag. I don't know why they left it in there. So. And it was an honest mistake. Like, I don't even play like that anymore. My mom was a flight attendant for Delta for 30 years. She's based out of here or oh, Atlanta? New York. She oh, New York? Oh. She's born, raised here. Me and her have a condo in Miami. My premier is tomorrow. Wait, you'll make you'll make it tomorrow. And worst case, worst case is I'll tell you, you get booked. You have to physically. That's worst case scenario. You have to physically go to jail, bond out, which usually takes six six hours or so, and then you get out and you could make a late flight out. You know, that's the worst case scenario. Uh, the address on your driver license is that a good uh, address or? I just looked it up because I see your team like, what is from that show? But I don't, I've never watched that show. It's a good one, huh? Yeah. I'm from Saturday, two Thank hours. You. Yeah. Alright, Coco. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you sure you don't need to get phone calls, bro? I'm going to wait till they're done. I don't want to disrespect them. Oh, okay. Okay. You don't have to phone you. Hey, phone. Yeah, they look out for you. He's not in charge, though, so it's not up to him, you know, so he's not in charge. The sergeant hasn't showed up yet. Once he shows up, he's going to How you doing, brother? How you doing, yourself? Doing all right. Doing all right. No, no, he's not. No. Just ran over here. Give me a second. Get my breath. <laughs> Very good. Uh, apparently, um, he's an actor with the show BMF. His security, armed security, apparently packed his bag for him. And apparently, they left some guns and ammo in his bag in the rush to catch this flight. Okay. And he's claiming that his flight was booked by agents and the flight was full, so he's separated from the security right now. But he's saying he could call security, but he personally does not have a CCF. So that's, that's where we're at right now. Were you on a flight or? No, no, there's several now in the airport. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't even know. Everything changes here. Like hey, we're trying to make, you know, get our word out. That way you guys know you give us a call if you need any hand or need to go get lunch or coffee for you. <laughs> Uh, the officer is just handling the cases over there with the bag, with the firearms. Oh, black one? No, no. The, uh, the oldest looking car here. <laughs> we got putting in old ones? Yeah, unfortunately my car broke down, so this is the one we got right now. <laughs> it's got more room than my car. So. 